could share your favorite bug with us? Praying mantis. Praying mantis. Thank you. Santa. <laughs> I have been really, really good this year. And I would do anything if you would make my little sister go away. <laughs> I do not need anything else for Christmas this year. Um, I don't need, gosh, I'll, I'll, I'll give up like snacks and dessert for like a month and um, I would do anything to just be an only child again. Jamie! Uh. Are you serious? Thank you, Santa. Santa's not the only one who heard that. Hi, Joe. You want to be an only child? So bad. Why? Why? Oh god, it feels like very clear when you're just coming Why? in. Why? Well, you just tried to pray me away. <laughs> Santa, that's so rude, Jamie. Seriously. Hey, just, just You could ask for like a gift like a normal kid, but instead you were like, who's the my sister? That's so rude. Hey, Deb. Ugh. Hey, Deb. What? I think it's time you and I had a talk. security logs show that nobody else entered the home between 6 p.m. and 8.55. How can you account for that? Hmm. It seems to me that this is a very serious case. Yeah. Anyone it's a murder would, trial. Well, any good murderer would not have entered in a way the security log would have been able to track. 
So but you, wait, okay. <laughs> you can take a minute. Yeah, no. <laughs> okay, cool. Okay, so you, so you're saying because you did enter in such a way as the security logs did, but you really can't smoke in here. <laughs> really? Just, uh, okay. All right. Fine. I, <laughs> <laughs> I, I, didn't, I heard it from you, I didn't hear it from the judge, and, well, yeah. Can I approach the bench? Can we approach the bench for just a second? Oh, sure. Can you <laughs> I didn't do anything to her. Like, I don't know why she's being like this. I'm just trying to do my job, and um, I, I just, I'm, I'm doing the best I can. Honestly, Tom, I just think you should keep going. You know, I think we should move this along. It's, I think you're... You know, it's like a little, this is a little unprofessional of you. Okay. Okay. Samantha, you, you took Samantha, the, the, you know, you took when, the when we broke up, you promised you wouldn't bring it <laughs> up here. Okay. You said this wouldn't happen. You just brought it up. I brought it up, but you were bringing it up right here. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, this, is, <laughs> this has absolutely nothing to do with you. Wow, okay. <laughs> I was promised on my birthday that I would get to go to Maggiano's, and I... I was there. I was there. Where were you? Where were you? I, I need I someone bet, I can count I on. I bet he wasn't at Maggiano. Thank you, sister. He was not at Maggiano. <laughs> this is what we need to get to the bottom of. <laughs> Where were you the next birthday? <laughs> okay, this is not about me. This is not. This is not what this is going to be. All right. This is. We're not. We're not doing a switcheroo here. I am. I am a lawyer. Okay? And, okay, you can't do that here. I, we have places for these things. I'm just, uh, I, I am here to, to talk about a murder trial, not, not some night where I was supposed to be at a restaurant and I was not there. Okay, it wasn't just some night, okay? It was my birthday. Okay, um, so. <laughs> so I think it's actually more important than that. Right, no, and I'm, I'm just saying that it's like, wait, I'm just trying to do my job. I'm just trying to do my job. Oh, okay, great. Well, your job is so much more important than mine, because you wear a robe and I just wear a coat and tie. I'm a person, too, with feelings and thoughts and opinions. Oh. <laughs> Strong case. <laughs> I believed it. <laughs> <laughs> Um, so I like to just start off an interview, um, kind of asking about about uh, uh, you know your aspirations, kind of where you see yourself in five years. Um, so so yeah, where do you see yourself in five years? Here, <laughs> working here. That's it. This is what I want. I want to work here. I, I'm going to be here in five years. That's where I see myself. Okay. Well, like specifically, like is there any? I mean, we love that attitude. But like any specific position, do you need water or something? Whichever like position is available. I'll, yeah, I'll take some water. That would be great. Yeah. Thank you. Um, yeah, so uh, the, the, the marketing coordinator position. That's uh, where I see myself. <laughs> as marketing coordinator. Yeah. In five how, years? Yeah. That's, well, in five years, I'll fill whatever positions would come after that position. <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right, let's let's uh let's move on to the next the next question. Okay, that's, okay? that's great. Thank All right, you. great. So um, uh, your last job, uh, it just says you were there for for just six months. So I was just wondering, uh, what, what what made you not want to really stick around there? What what what, what changed? Um, fire. Uh, there was a fire. <laughs> I'm serious. It was, there was a fire and. <laughs> <laughs> Did you lose? So, okay, that's right. This is a super sensitive question, but like usually, like when there's a fire, like we would move offices or like reconstruction would oh, happen. Oh, they didn't have any insurance. Oh my god. So that was just the end of that Kinkos, you know. <laughs> <laughs> it was just like they, there was some Kinkos one day, and the next, the next day they were like, just good luck. You know? <laughs> Let's skip right past it and go to the next. Um, uh, 
So on your special skills, um, I think it's it's uh, it's great that you've got a driver's license and you speak French. Um, but I was, <laughs> okay. um, but I, was uh, I was super interested in, uh, in in this section here where you just say totally gets it. I what do you mean by that? I get it. No, I just get it. Whatever it is, I get it. You know, whatever you need to be gotten, I've got it, and I get it. You know what I'm saying? I get it. Right? I get it. Isn't that great? I got it. I got it. Right? We we got like a bunch more interviews um, to do. Um, sure. Do you need a break or anything? I, I know we've only been at this for three minutes, but um, you seem winded. <laughs> no. I appreciate how sensitive you are. Oh, thank you. Where do you see yourself in five years? <laughs> um, I guess like, like here. Um, like if I was to see myself in like five years, I would think like maybe I'm like, I don't know, it's gonna be anxious thinking about it, but like right here, like, right? In, the job, like in the job I have right now, I think, um, like seems like pretty, pretty okay. It seems like pretty good where I'm at. Oh my God, this is stressful on the other side of this. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh ma'am, I think you dropped a, a, a watch there. Oh, I don't know. I don't think that was, um, I don't know. Like, that doesn't look like something I would wear. I saw it fall off your wrist. Do you want me to, I can just pick it up for you. Mm -hmm. Okay, thanks. Do you not, I don't have to pick up the watch for you. I mean, I, I saw it fall off your fall off your wrist, and it says, like, to, to Clara, my one and only on the back. So I, I don't know. It, it might be sentimental. Or... Yep. Was it try, I wasn't trying to lose it. So thank you for helping me find it. something? <laughs> you want to talk to me about no, it? No. Okay. No. No. Um, you know that point in a relationship when you know it's going to end? And you think that one thing could just kind of send it over the edge? <laughs> this watch was really important and I thought I could make a, an effective mistake. You know, like if I lost this watch, it would show how inconsiderate I am. And then that would just be it. But wow, that's really <laughs> now I've got it. Back into your, you can give me the watch. I didn't mean to put you back into like no, a relationship. No, you know, it's gotta have that kind of genuine, dropped it on the ground sort of moment. There is nobody else around. I, like you could just hand it to me, and I'll, I'll walk away. I don't want you to be in a situation you don't want to be in. Okay. It seems like you might not want to give me the watch. Sorry, do you have to go somewhere? Oh yeah, I mean, I just my my wife's waiting for me at dinner, but it's not a big deal. I can I can I can talk to Magiano just right over there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's really nice that you take her to dinner. Oh, we try to do special things. Actually, I, we used to do that. I got her this uh, this necklace. It's, she thinks I forgot it's her birthday, but I I care a bunch, so I I, I did get her something. Um, but if you need to talk for a second, I mean I'm. I got it. I got a second. I should be more caring like you. You know what? We can't all be me. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I think you went this way. Sarah? Mm -hmm. I think you went this way. in the violent crimes unit, you're going to have to start getting used to like a little bit of the stuff. Uh, okay. Okay. I got this. I got this. Yes, you definitely was going that way. Yep. Are you alright? I'm great. Okay. I'm great. Okay, cool. Well, from what I could tell from, from what was going on in the living room and what I found in the hallway, it looks like she probably se like severed his uh, carotid artery and then uh, uh, fled down the hallway. Um, oh my god! I found uh, a lot of human uh, fecal matter and semen out in the hallway by oh the end there, god. and I no, think uh, uh, I can't no, do it. What? please, no. Oh my god! 
no. I mean, put him back on the desk. I do the paperwork and just, you know, fill out the forms. People need to park places. I'll help them do the parking permits. Let's hurt the desk. <laughs> Hey, so um, I was uh, taking pictures of a scene earlier today, and I need you to file these for me. Um, sure. This is a bunch of the fecal matter, and um, a bunch of the blood that's got in there. Um, if, you could, uh, if you could actually zoom in on this area, this area, and enhance for me, um, I'd really appreciate it. The, the, you know, the violent crimes unit, can't they do that? They, I don't want to zoom They used to ship it up to the Kinkos, but it went down. <laughs> Again, we don't have the Kinkos anymore. We're all picking up extra slack at the Kinkos. Kinkos, did, that? Kinkos did most of the police officer work. <laughs> <laughs> that I've seen, the things that the agency puts us on. Okay. You gotta do what you can do to make it through the day. I'm just saying, like, maybe just go right outside, or like, maybe smoke by, you know, some of the- God, you sound like my ex-wife! Okay! <laughs> Honestly, this is not, this is not about her. I just really like this job, and I don't, you know, I just don't want to get in trouble you know or anything. What? Every day, I hear all these things from people telling me how to live my life, how to do the things that I am supposed to do. I, I am here just trying to do a job. I am just a man in the world put here on a mission. I work at a Kinko's and I solve goddamn crimes, okay? I'm a, oh, that's really starting up there. Ken, help me. You have to help me put this fire out. Oh, I, um, I got this reservation. You're gonna blame um, this on me. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get out of here, um, but you, uh, you seem to have this taken care of. Um, what are you talking about? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, the thing that I was gonna... <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, no! It's all going in flames! <laughs> Sorry, I forgot my lunch. <laughs> Uh, no, but it seems great. <laughs> I remember how excited I was the first time I got to prison. <laughs> Endless time. I'm gonna read, like, so much. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You're gonna catch up on your reading. Yeah, and I'm yeah. Gonna get, I, think, I think I'm like, probably gonna get into shape. I'm oh, really excited yeah. about that. <laughs> yeah, lots of weightlifting and... Yeah. Yeah. Well, oh, hey, I'm sorry, I'm Paul. <laughs> I'm not giving you money. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> you have to earn that here. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, no, I'm happy to do anything like that. I'm really looking forward to joining a gang. Um, <laughs> sorry, is there a place for toiletries that you've already, like, assigned? Because I don't want to encroach on any of your space. Okay. Um, I don't think you're approaching this the right way. Oh, oh my gosh. I'm so sorry. Do we, like, share toiletries here? I'm happy to do whatever. Oh, my gosh. Why are you so excited? What's really, what are you running away from? Can I tell you something? Yeah, I literally just asked you a question. <laughs> <laughs> tell me, literally tell me. Do you mind if I let you in on something? Yes, oh my god. <laughs> I have something I want to share with you. Um, I used to be this high powered lawyer mm. and it was stressful. My, my wife was kind of my boss, and the clients didn't respect you at all, mm -hmm. and it's really hard to get another reservation at Maggiano's, but in here, <laughs> <laughs> in here I don't have to worry about, about any of that. In here, I don't, I don't have a wife. I don't think there is a Maggiano's. Is there? There's not a There's not a Maggiano's. <laughs> <laughs> and that's great. So you, you know, you were a high-powered lawyer. You remember all your clients, right? Uh, I have face blindness. <laughs> it's real. That is something that people who don't pay attention use as an excuse. <laughs> I'm not an inconsistent.
considerate person, um, if that's what you're saying. You don't remember me? 